The X-ray fish. The X-ray fish is a fish you can see through. These fish have very little skin. It just covers their bellies. The rest of the body is covered in a thin silver sac. You can see the bones of these fish. That is why they are called X-ray fish. There are a few spots of color on these fish, but not many. These fish come from South America. The tropical river areas have a lot of these little fish. They are freshwater fish, not saltwater fish. Although the X-ray fish can live in almost any type of water. Now many of them live in homes called aquariums. Aquariums are homes that people make for fish and other water animals. Aquariums can be as small as a tiny fishbowl, or as large as a football field. X-ray fish don't like to swim at the top or bottom of rivers and aquariums. They like swimming in the middle depths. These fish establish their own territories in aquariums. They mark out certain spots between plants, and they tend to stay much of their time in these spots. Male and female partners usually swim in groups, but they rest close to one another. Males are thinner than females. The females lay eggs, and can have lots of baby X-ray fish. X-ray fish are very popular aquarium fish, and can be found in most all tropical fish stores. They do well with flake fish food, but they are omnivores. This means that they eat not only plants but also other fish. Any fish they eat have to be small, though, because both male and female X-ray fish are only about one inch long. Fish can be wonderful pets, however, they do require a lot of care. For freshwater fish, their water must be kept fresh. This means that fish owners have to change water often. Usually, people buy filters for larger fish tanks if they keep more than a few fish. The filter keeps the water fresh by circulating it continuously. The chemical balance and temperature of the water have to be appropriate; otherwise, the fish can get sick and die. X-ray fish are some of the easiest fish to care for, because they survive well in non-moving water. In hard water, with few minerals, and in soft water, with more minerals. Fish owners do have to be careful about their mix of fish. Some types of fish get along better than others. The fish habitat needs to be planned well to provide the right features for the types of fish that the owners collect.